Hey everyone, I'm Sister Lilia and welcome to my armory. So, oops, it stopped. Look at me having to turn it. Um, so here we have my um, preacher podium for my Ministorum army. But that um, I did as a prelude to doing Junitharitia, and um, I figured I'd show it off. So here we have. Looks like the light levels have changed. But yes, anyway. Um, so essentially it's a grav podium that I've got riding on a purity seal. That's going into the base. And the purity seal is the structural thing. This isn't some anti-grav miracle. This is me having a purity seal as a support. But essentially, instead of doing flying stems that are clear plastic, why not just do a purity, structural purity seal like... Um, you could probably use clip, use some slightly thicker um, high-impact polystyrene plastic for purity seals that you mount on the back, and use that on the back of Seraphim. But yes, so the podium. This project actually was my first experiment, both with green with um, milliput and with both a black wash and a green wash on the base. And it kind of looks pretty good. Um, Probably could go back and go over the little icon there, but that happens. We have some icons there. I'll be going back to this at some point in the distant distant future and um, adding more details onto it when I can be bothered. Um, essentially, this is at the point where I'm happy to leave it and um, where it still where it does look pretty good. Um, And the preacher on top I scored last year is um, off an eBay bid. Well, off an eBay um, win. So, yeah, because why not have my own um, Arch Confessor? That being said, I need to actually strip him and paint him. Because um, I don't like the paint job. The white's a bit thicker than I'd normally do, and um, I wouldn't do white on a priest. Too many negative connotations for me. Um, I'd much rather cream. But yes, that and the Ministorum aren't actually all the, as pure as they want to pretend. So yes, like, like I've got the um, engines on here that I need to kind of do more white paint on. Uh, put some white paint in and make it look a bit more like the actual gra jet engines. But otherwise, this thing's probably just going to be counted as a bit of terrain that um, is an airborne hazard for aircrafts to avoid. <laughs> I'm more than happy to set up some airborne terrain to make flying a little more hazardous in my games. Because flyers normally have open rain of the sky, but that's not how things work on busier Imperial worlds, especially Hive worlds, where there's usually, t on certainly richer Hive worlds, or even busy Hive worlds like Vigilus, there's, um, Vigilus isn't really a Hive world, is it? It's kind of a world with lots of hives and various other things. Um, but yes... Essentially, um, the skies are usually a bit more busy, but anyway, here's how my preacher podium's coming along. This model I did as a um, prelude to doing a Junitharitia scratch build that I will show off the whole process of much later on. Well, I say much later, I mean later on when I get it done. Um, yes, pardon the complaining noise of the motor. Um, of the turntable, but it's a, it has a very temperamental machine spirit. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and if you'd um, like to see more stuff like this, feel free to let me know. I do plan on when I get my Ministorum army up to the point where I'm happy to actually properly do photo shoots of them. I will share this model probably looming over my Ministorum elements, not the sisters themselves. The sisters have their own stuff. Um, with him standing, with this guy riding atop the podium and um, the rest of the units around them, with the units kind of arrayed in front of and around him as um, they charge forward out of the gates of some ch some convent or chapel. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed.